Welcome back to the Evil Within. We are at the beginning of chapter 7, which I just noticed is titled The Keeper. For those of you who don't know, it was heavily advertised. Um, there was a, some sort of boss with a safe on his head. Uh, it was like since the game's announced, they've been showing him off a lot, and I guess that's the Keeper. So we get to meet him, I guess, sometime in this chapter. A beautiful looking church on the inside, I like it. Very gothic. I hear screaming, is that Kidman? That sounded like, close. We're looking for Kidman, I think that's why we're here, and Joseph's looking worn. You have to stay with me, there's no other way. That I think Leslie was his name or her name. Yeah. Map fragment. Still don't know what those do, but I know I'm gonna want to go back through and get all the collectibles at some point. And I did hear there's a new game plus when you beat it, so that's exciting. <laughs> and a harder difficulty. Hey, Joseph, you still with me? Sebastian, you ever had the urge to just jump? Oh God. When you're on a high place, <coughs> where the subway rolls by. Imagine if you had that urge for a minute straight, then two minutes. You fought it off three times now, Joseph. You're learning to stop it. You're not listening. I'm not worried about stopping it, Seb. I'm worried about not wanting to stop it. Some part of me wants to turn. I don't know why, and I can't reason it away. It's deeper than that. It's like instinct. Much as I like him, I don't want to see him go, I think. Uh, it'd be best if we just shoot him now. It was like the last chapter, I had, a, like, had something like three bosses, a couple big fights. So this one's off to a good start already, if we're gonna have to fight him now. Hmm. This one's getting pretty intense. Oh. Good news is I think we're pretty good on ammo, at least to start with, because uh, last chapter we stocked up on it quite a bit. Let's see, we got four shotgun shells, which is a lot to have in this game. Seven pistol rounds, a few different bolts, and six sniper rounds. A laboratory under the church. I'd better start searching for my partners. Let's not forget to look for some goo because we do need upgrades.
Think we can get it? I don't have any syringes to use, so... I am really bad at that. And again, I forgot it doesn't cycle. I just, I mean, it just goes through once and you don't have a second chance. Need some syringes. Hey. Yeah, I need to upgrade my syringe recovery, so like one of those will go a lot further, you know. A hidden passage or something. Sounded like when they were talking there from over here. I hear breathing. I don't know if you guys saw that perfect hole that was in that guy's head, that was pretty awesome. I had a couple of my friends that had this game talking about that, asking me if I'd seen that yet. Just, damn, these guys just do not die. The ammo doesn't go very far in this game. if they give me anything back when I burn them. I wanted to do that a lot more stealthily, but I came around that corner to see what was there and immediately saw me. Probably shouldn't have had my light on. I always have it on when I should have it off, and I always have it off when I should have it on. If something came out of the coffin, some scary. At least we have a lot of parts, so if we start running low on ammo, we can make some bolts. I'm really happy I got this game. I also have the uh, season pass for it. So later on, when the DLCs start coming out, I'll probably put those up too. Looks loose. Is this where I was supposed to go? Or this lithograph was pried from a stone door where it seems to have been used as a key. Oikes, let me see what's over here first. Oh. Whoa. So we got a decent amount of revolver ammo now. Is that a different lantern? Like an upgraded lantern or something? Um, so this makes me nervous here. See the 
Catacomb now help to the metallic pounding. He's coming. I run to I run but he follows. Help God help 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 help. Okay, so that's terrifying. This is the exact safe that I remember seeing in his head. I really am nervous now. There's a key in it. Oh, okay. I love this area, it's so creepy. Holy crap, that's dark. Is that him? Holy shit. At least we're getting a decent amount of goo. I hear the music. Lily's birth announcement. We welcome with love Lily Lynn Castellanos, born July 18, 2006, 956 AM, 7 pounds, 3 ounces, 14 inches. Proud parents Sebastian and Myra Castellanos. I'm gonna go save real quick, and then we'll come back and deal with this safe head guy. Catacombs found beneath Parish. The worrying type, I see. I'm gonna upgrade some of them first. I wanna I think upgrade either weapon damage if I can or syringe recovery. I'm trying to do look more upgrades and stuff off camera. <laughs> Ugh, then I actually have to hit them in the head to get the extra. See what is life gauge. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just save up a bunch and then I'll do some upgrades later because I'm not even sure what I want. And I'm a little ways off from upgrading damage on the guns. So let's save. And go face our fears. <coughs> Oh, I got a key too, but you know, I don't really need ammo that bad right now or anything, so hopefully it'll be alright. So I think I have to use that stone thing I got as a key to open this, but I don't know if I really want to. <laughs> I'd rather just can't open these, can I? Looks like there's two more that I need to get. Uh oh, uh oh. No, 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 no. There's where it turns into a Tomb Raider or Zelda or something. I'll go left first. Uh, so our, our prize when we go find the other two pieces is to come back and fight that guy. That's great. What's going on down here? Freaky double doors. Like, wow, is this not a scary little environment to go through? Holy shit. Those things even have heads? Is this, what is going on? What the hell is that? Oh, it's like one of the double headed ones from the chapter 2 cutscene. See if he turns around again. Pretty fast, though, isn't he? He's gonna turn back around and see me. Maybe not. Oh, there's one in here. Oh. I 
Is he dead? No. Nope. You know what I'm looking at. I just know I don't want him to get close. Jesus. That's the thing, you think you have a good amount of ammo and then these things just fucking eat it all up. I kinda wanna see what's in here, but... Can I open this? Hey friend. I've come to say hi. Nope. Well, that was pretty good. Upgraded. I think I did upgrade the critical hits for the shotgun, so... See if I got anything from him. Nope. Well, I didn't want to kick it. Hey, bottle. Been a while since Bottle Man had a bottle in his bottle hand. See if we can use it to pull off some stealth kills and save some ammo. I'm a little bit worried about this one. Creaky doors, man. Got a hatchet? Fuck the bottle. Yep, I was right to worry. I didn't even kill him, did it? Oh, it did, okay. Now we'll take the bottle back. Downstairs or upstairs? We're going down. Is this really going to be worth it? You know what I haven't tried out yet? Oh. I wonder if I can get him through the door. Okay. Not bad. Oh. Still alive. Or no, those two are dying, aren't they? No. Oh wow, I didn't even light him on fire. Let's just burn everything. Three bodies, come on, you gotta give me some ammo or something from that. A little bit of goo, it looks like. Being a little stingy with supplies. Maybe this was worth it though, I got some sniper rounds and some goo. And some more scrap. And a syringe. Keep this just in case. I hate these things. They're so difficult to fucking disarm and it's just risk reward. It's not worth it on that. Oh god damn it now, do I I go down the ladder first, or do I? Can I disarm it like the other one? Um, <laughs> that fucking scared the shit out of me. I have a feeling those things are not to be trusted, especially considering that one guy has one on his head. What is this? Oh, I could have killed them the easy way. Oh well. We did okay. Just would have saved us ammo. So this is not locked. I thought it was locked. What is. Oh! It's wondering what was glowing. Oh, I got my grenade back.
Jesus, that scared me. Um, no. No, 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 no. Yeah, separate each other. Oh, well. Um. Can I grab that, please? And then maybe need that later. Damn ammo, you piece of shit. Come <laughs> down, or do I see what's over here first? Oh, there's nothing over here. Settles it. <laughs> Come on, grab the ladder. Alright, we got a checkpoint, so that is good news. <laughs> oh my god, I, I knew these guys were going to be worse. Oh, come on. They're blocking it, I can't. Fuck off. Out of ammo. I, I thought I had one shotgun shell left. Doesn't even give you the chance to sneak on these guys anymore. Um. enough it might have been enough okay let's use both of them These guys just do not die Beginning of the game, I thought you know the match. The whole point of the matches was to uh, keep them from coming back to life on you and shit. But uh, I'm starting to realize it's more just to try to get supplies from them because most of them don't really seem to come back like that. Let's make some more bolts. Gonna need a well, regular. Gonna have a flash. Those are good. I like those. Like an incinerary. I don't know about poison. Poison doesn't seem like it's all that effective, but maybe on certain enemies. Incinerary seems good, but it uses a lot of parts. We have sniper rounds, so we better start using those because we're maxed out. That way we can grab more when we find it. We're low on everything else. A little labyrinth here. I don't know which way to go.
I don't know, I kind of want to see what's down there now, because I feel like this is the main way. Nothing. I bet we'll come back running back through this area for something, though. <laughs> oh, is this gonna be like some sort of puzzle of like opening and closing different doors? I don't trust these pipes. Oh, what is this? Oh! Whew, that was close. I've never seen one like that directly in the ground. They're usually... They were curved ball at us. Oh, well. I'm gonna shoot at him. I better hit him. At least the sniper's pretty effective. So it seems like if you shoot the monstrous looking head, not the human looking head, um, it kills them faster. <laughs> the other one will just explode and they'll keep going at you. At least that's what I think is going on. I don't trust it. <laughs> I ended up having to come back through here or anything, and I don't want these guys coming up on me. Plus, I got a pretty decent amount of matches. Okay, so I think we're on the other side of that gate from before. Um. Ah. I think we did a good job upgrading the bolt capacity so we can have three of each bolt now. Makes it a lot more efficient. That way you can stock them up. I don't use the bolts as much. So we got the other second piece. And we need to go down that other hallway and get the third one, but that guy is out there so he's probably going to be chasing us. The keeper. Oh, we got a checkpoint just now, so that's good. Just one more. I'm gonna go ahead and save and end this one here and start another episode. So I think it was about 25 minutes or so, something like that. Uh, but thank you for watching and please join us next time. <laughs>